Hands up! Let's do one more quickly. Here we are in the north of Israel, in the first day of shooting of season three. It's over, guys! Don't set that off! You haven't won! I'm not trying to play! First day on set, we jumped right into the action. Go ahead! I'd rather take the win. I couldn't have asked for a better scene to start the season with. Sun was rising when we got to the top of this huge mountain. These mountains here in Israel are no joke. It's a very complicated scene, obviously. The stunt coordinators, the green screen. Luckily for us, we have Cynthia, who is a great actress. She makes it look real. Help! Help! Seeing how that's all going to come together, it's so magical. Help! Help! We are making a TV show. This is amazing. Let's just finish this. Agreed. It's me wanting to beat. Daniel. You're not gonna win. Haley's with me. I already did. He swooped in and he's taken the, the fair lady. <laughs> I need something. I need this win. It's over, guys. No, it's not. Alex and Max are hurt. We all decided to call for help. You haven't won. I'm not trying to win. Come on. Sophie always wants to win. I definitely understand why he didn't buy any of it. <laughs> Sophie is falling off the cliff and I have to like jumping down, grabbing her arm. My head is I was just imagining me being in that situation, and it's just utter panic. Hang on! I can't! It's that moment of, I'm going to die. <laughs> I mean, we're not actually off the cliff, but we're on this ledge. Ah! I'm just sitting there, and I'm just like sweating in the heat. This is the last thing I'm going to look at, Leo. No! Ah! Oh my okay, God, hang on! <laughs> and then we broke for lunch, and everything was good. <laughs> So good to see that you're all right. I can't believe I let this happen. It's all my fault. Sophie falling off of that cliff is an iconic scene in the Chachamama series. As someone who wrote uh, many cliffhangers in different shows, I always had a dream to write a cliffhanger that's actually literally Cliffhanger. As soon as I got the part, Giora had mentioned to me that I was going to be falling off the cliff. So I've been excited for this day since before we started shooting the series. Sophie was chosen to be the one who falls because it drives several stories, actually. We actually found out Lewis had Coach Davis mess with us in the woods. So you all lied about what happened? Do you want my father to lose his job over this stupid hike? This is the catalyst for all of the change in the season. If Lewis has taught me anything, it's that a great leader should always speak their mind. Lewis being removed from the greenhouse as the headmaster, and it's what introduces Ryan coming in, which then changes so much of the dynamic of the characters. I always try to find ways to connect stories, to not have separate storylines move in parallel, but rather have them interwine. Hey. In the first season, we see that Sophie's sort of still trying to find her own voice. But that fall, that incident, she's the only one out of the group that stands up for what's right. It's really fun to see how much Sophie has grown up. <laughs>